All right, so we're still here at Micro Center, and I have to admit, this is the most deceiving laptop I have ever seen. Because for something like this, I'm thinking this thing would cost about $300, you know, maybe four. And if you look at it, it doesn't have a video card. And so I asked the guy, what was the price on this? And he's like, that's the price. I was like, there's no freaking way that this thing costs $1,300 for this thing. You want to show me really quick what it does? Yeah. Basically, two-in-one flip with the touch. It will actually rotate. You don't want to see that. Close. That easy. I, I want to open it. That easy. The, this is the most deceiving laptop I've ever seen. So basically, it's under three pounds. So you're paying for the light, portable, I want to pick it up and go. But you want to have power. So it's an i7-16 with a solid stick. Usually for this price, wow. you're getting... You're looking for something with an RGB keyboard, something that has NVIDIA or AMD drive in here, uh, graphics card. That's a gamer Maybe. graphics guy look at it though. A lot of guys, they want the power. They don't care, they're a business person. They're not a gamer dude, so they don't care about the graphic card. Right, right. They want, I gotta pick it up, I gotta go. Right. They don't care about. But even still, a few years ago, I had a business laptop and the cheapest, well-performing laptop I found that had touchscreen was about seven hundred dollars. Yeah, it was. A, I think it was an HP. It was the mo the best performance touchscreen-based laptop was about seven hundred dollars. Low-end NV, maybe. Uh, it wasn't a Spectre. It was an Intel. Yeah, it was, no, no, it, that's the type. So HP goes by. We're just straight numbers to Pavilion to Pavilion Plus. Then I'll go NV Spectre. Or the other side is the Omen Gamer dude, or the Pro Book, which is their business side. I had no, I had no idea this thing would have flipped one way, flapped the other. They had no idea it was touchscreen. I don't even think there's anything on here. It doesn't even list. It doesn't list it as a touchscreen. You can usually check by the hinges. Like, okay, look at that one. Right. No hinges. Oh, not don't. a touchscreen. <clears throat> right. Don't you, tell me this one flips. That. Don't tell me this one flips here. Yet. No. And you're still looking at <coughs> i7 12 core, 32 gig, 2 terabyte. Yeah, see, that's, I get this. Yeah, see, I get that's I, wrong. That's a 3050, not a 2050. That's okay. Stupid. But see, I get this, though. I look at the price, I see what it is, look at the size of the screen. It says G4 is RTX. I'm like, okay, $1,800. And you're still paying because it's under three pounds. Right. Yeah, see, I'm, I, I looked at it, but that one totally caught me off guard. I can see why. I was like, no, nah, maybe this is over here. This is, I was like, where's the, what's the price on this? Like, where is it? Him, it this. Like, I was like, no. Nah. No. I always listen to your wife. No. Men. <laughs> no. I, I got none, so. This thing is light <laughs> as heck. This thing is light like the... And you can... You that's what you're paying for. It. No, the, I, I the mean, I... Is, I'll, yeah, that's exactly what you're paying for. I never would have guessed that. They thing want the power. Dollars. They want the speed. They don't care about the graphics. They're business people. They want to have eight windows, ten windows open at once. Yeah. And that's what they're paying for. So right now when most people come in here and buy this, you're saying they're real estate agents and who else? Business professionals. Like social workers or anything or like me. Like people doing presentations. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. How good is it on like printing or anything like that? Like print, okay. like a printer. I like usually that. put that up on the network, okay. whatever network you're on. Is it good based on like built-in Wi-Fi? Yeah, it's got the new AX Wi-Fi 6. Okay. So it actually should be, yeah, dual band, Wi-Fi 6 with Bluetooth 5.1. So it's there as far as specs go. Man. DDR5, probably PCI 4 for the solid state. Let's see, I'm going to input this is half. Only one USB. Yep, one USB SSD. 3. The other side should have USB-C. You, you can get an adapter for it or whatever. Yeah, a lot of them do that. What's the size internal drive, hard drive? 16, one terabyte. One terabyte. So, it's all safe. Okay. Wow. Totally got me. Got, had me full. Totally had it, me it's full. Right, for what it is, it's right in the range of anything else. Like the XPS 13, the Surface Pro. They're all going to be floating at that number for those specs. Right. Yeah, the Surface Pro, I mean, I can see it, but it's geared towards, you know, because they use that in the NFL, you know. And I know, I was the first guy to sell them to them. Oh, you did? 
Yeah, it pissed me off. No, I sold them to them, a bunch of players. I was the only guy old enough to recognize who these guys were. Right. They came in, I sold them, and then all of a sudden I find out. Wait, you were I, working here? or? Yeah. And they came in, they bought them for me, and then they got a hold of Microsoft Microsoft themselves. Took it, I'm like. And you didn't get any commission. I'm your guy. <laughs> you know, now you're not. Now, oh, I'm man. Like, I can say they, I was the one they originally set it up. Wow. Kind of. I was a. Like, I feel you, man. I I, I okay. know. I feel your pain. I know exactly I what you're talking about. On too, what do you All right, guys. Well, we're signing out here from Micro Center. Thanks for watching. But I just wanted to make this quick video because, man, that had, had me going. I had no idea. Wow. Will you buy your wife something for her birthday? Honey, come on now. Of course. Mm -hmm. Well, look, they even got a turtle in there for you. Mm -hmm. wow. wow, that's nice. And it, it's purple, like what your wife's favorite color is. This doesn't light up or anything. So the only thing is, this is you can't use no, this in the dark. Actually, yes, you can. But just, hopefully, fan. it has some type of backlight on here. Yes, it does. It's a oh. backlight. Oh, it does. Well, does it? I can't really. It's high beam, low beam. It's, it's high low, beam. Beam, low beam. Okay. High beam, low beam, no beam. Mm -hmm. And I can download. Um, iTeams. You can download it whatever so, you want on that. That's yeah, there, that's yeah, if you catch it camera. at the angle, you can see the lip right now. Yeah, I can see it. Okay, you can, you can see it. So it does have a... Uh, yeah, yeah, high beam, low beam, no beam. Black light. So it annoys me about my XPS 15. All I gotta do is touch something and the keys light up. <laughs> I don't want you to do that right now. Well, watch my video. I don't need you. I don't need the keys floating around in the background. Or foreground in that case. Yeah, you can always get an ad additional adapter to expand the uh, desktop as well. Yeah. To have two monitors. Or and I can upload my videos mm -hmm. for my birthday. Or well, you you don't want to put too many videos on something like this on a one terabyte. This is more or less just main for to travel and yeah, wherever you would get an external drive for something like that. Well, that's what I want. Or a thumb drive. Yeah. I've got videos on thumb drives now. Well, that's and my what buddies pick me pitch me flat for it. I'm like, what? I can throw it in my pocket. I can take it over to my girlfriend's. Plug it in. You watch the movie. <clears throat> so the regular price on this, I just noticed, is seventeen hundred bucks. Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're paying for the power and the light puddle, just like I said. That's... So how much is the Surface Pro by itself? Ah, uh, similar specs. Well, come on. Yeah. What's? I7, 16 gigs, 6, 12. It's the same price. That's a 512, not the one terabyte. The kicker for me, 32 gig. This is the closest one I'm going to have to that one. But then you're still without a keyboard on that one. You're looking at 180 up or down 10 bucks for the keyboard, another 130 for the pen. Right. Unless you find surface. Well, you don't have to use a pen if it's touchscreen, right? Or do you? Is it? You don't have to. <coughs> Sometimes we have the bundle deal, and of course I do. Okay. Sometimes we'll have the bundle deal where you'll get the keyboard or the keyboard and the pen with it. Right. And I don't have that. Oh, I see. Someone was telling me they had the Surface Pro 7 right. from Microsoft. I think it was $7.99. I'm like, you want the older version? <laughs> it's out of date. That's Windows 10 that's going to be done in less than two years. That, well... So, I like Windows 10. I don't like Windows 11. Yeah, but everything's going to, in less than two years, it's going to be this year, next year. Right. And then, bam, January's going to hit. 10's done. I like A bunch 10. of my buddies pitched me flat because I just, I got a $2,000 XPS 15. Right. And Windows 8 was done, so I upgraded to Windows 10, put a new battery in it. Mm -hmm. And they're like, why'd you spend 100 bu something bucks, 200 bucks on a six plus year old laptop? I was like, almost 4K type screen graphics do right i can th stick a thumb drive in with my portfolio and my clients work and they can do this 
and it's got an amazing picture. Oh, that's nice. I can watch my YouTube videos. That's all it's there for. Show off my work and watch YouTube videos. Yeah, just productivity. Just something bigger than a regular iPhone, you know, iPad with Windows. I bought it from here, but I bought it and I stole it from my Literally. It was like, they basically went, here's a gift for you. Mm. I was like, okay. And I'm like, okay, to replace it, it's going to cost me seventeen to $4,000, depending on what I get. Something comparable, three grand. Mm, nice. So I'm like, yeah, it can last me two more years. Because all it's doing is this. And if I'm spending four grand, I'm going to business for myself. True. That's true. All right, man. Well, thanks for your help. Really appreciate it. We're here with another awesome rep here from Micro Center showing off the product. So make sure you guys come check them out. Peace. We're going to catch you guys later. Have a good weekend.